It wasn't like the mucositis we were seeing with chemotherapy. It even visually looks different, more like a canker sore. Um, it tends to have a, ray, a red middle and a little bit of a whitish gray outside. And so what we found was that when we were using steroids for those patients topically on the mucositis, it was actually he healing much more rapidly and patients were able to stay at full dose as opposed to when we were treating it like a chemotherapy mucositis, patients were needing dose reductions and it was more palliative not healing. And so things like um, triamcinolone, 0.1% dental paste, um, patients can apply topically to um, isolated or localized lesions, or we have the physicians order a dexamethasone mouth rinse for more diffuse mucositis, and we see it heal within 48 hours. And so the kind of the mechanism of why patients develop it is also a little bit different in terms of they think it really has to do with the impact on EGFR in the in the patient's system from the targeted therapy as opposed to kind of the rapid turnover that we see with chemotherapy.